today i got a query from my students regarding to the pattern detector and the pattern was asking 10110 and he is asking to draw a straight diagram for this one so in, so i thought ki, okay we will make a video for that one so because this is going to be helpful for the gate or ies exam as well as in the vlsi interview so many times pattern detector has got to know that pattern detector is the practical application of the fsm so first we will draw the state uh, diagram for this one what are the pattern okay if you want me to write a very low code for that one so you just let me know i will uh, uh, write down a code and i even i can run on uh, ada playground if you wish so let's start and start with the state diagram so i request you please adjust the speed of the video as per your convenient okay so we have to determine the pattern of 10110 from the stream uh, input data stream so it can be generated randomly 10110101101 like this data stream will come like that whenever the sequence detector okay this is the machine this is called sequence detector and you will put going to feed input here and this is the output so whenever this sequence detect this pattern it will be generate output as 1 okay otherwise it is going to be zero so we have to de uh, uh, determine this state diagram of this sequence detector okay so five bits are there so so you you know already five bits are there in this pattern so what you have to do you have to write a b c d e these are the five states okay five bits are there so you can determine five states so first state is simply considered as the reset state okay so reset state when you your pattern is not a uh, Come, uh, right now no bit is as per your pattern okay suppose uh, if uh, zero is coming instead of uh, one zero is coming so this is going to be zero by zero always keep in mind that uh, this zero is tells about the input this is the input okay this is the input bit and this is tell about the output okay whenever output is one pattern has been detected if output is zero pattern is not uh, detected so far okay now come back to the next state so we will consider whenever we, uh, the we will write the state diagram because this is the simpler uh, simplest way first of all we will find it out the sequence of the right pattern okay so suppose if one is there one will be come it will be jump to the b state okay so if uh, uh, machine is reached to this state it means already one has been achieved come back to the c c means uh, whenever uh, uh, zero is coming okay zero by zero it means this is the output is going to be zero since now our pattern is not detected this is the input stream then it will come back to here one zero again d so again when uh, you will see the pattern if one is coming one oblique zero so what exactly this mean this is the input stream one is coming it will jump into the d state and uh, d state mean 101 okay again if uh, again it will detect the one so it will come one output zero because zero output is still zero so 1011 if you are at the state e it means that you already achieved 1011 okay now come back to the next stream if zero is coming okay uh, like uh, if zero is coming 10110 it is coming zero is coming in the next uh, input then it is considered as the valid output the output should be one if one is coming then it is output is going to be zero only so there are two type of sequence detector one is overlapping hai na or another is non overlapping okay so suppose if uh, overlapping is there so we will, we have to be uh, manage up to again this is uh, suppose 100 zero, zero is coming as a input so now it is going to be 0101010 oh, and again if zero is coming na you can consider it from here here itself 100 so it will be jump to the 10 this is going to be jump to the this this state coming as input and the output is going to be 1 and it will be reach to the this one 1 c state why c state because 10 can be repeated from this pattern from the next pattern it will be start from 10 because 10 is already there in the pattern okay if suppose one is coming okay at the for this case what you will do you have to jump to the b b state okay. one is coming in that case output is not uh, we are not going to be get the output but we will start counting from this bit only okay this is 10111 so we will start counting from a to th this is the state b and it will jump from 1 uh, to 0 output is going to be 0 and input is 1 and it will reach to the b state so this is the diagram whenever when situation is exactly now come back to the come again come back to the states if a is there zero is there it will remain at the a state if one is there it will reach to the b state okay again zero is there it will reach to the c state if one is coming it will remain at the same state because 11 
it will be leave the pattern at the same state okay so this is 1 out of 0 okay and again come back to the c c if 1 0 1 is there it will come to the next state if 1 0 0 is there so then how much it will it no pattern is going to be repeated from this one so c is going to be repeat return back to this state okay again come back to the d d is uh, one is there it will go to the c state if zero is there one zero again one zero is there it will be jump to the c state d is going to be jump is at the c state zero by zero again come back to the e e we already discussed both the cases so what we need to be do we have to be consider the each state and the possibility of the uh, zero or one at one state if zero is coming where it need to go if one is coming where it need to go okay we have to consider that much only and after that we can easily determine which pattern what are the pattern is there so finally this is our required state diagram okay so a required state diagram hope you will get the points if any query is there just write it down in the comment section definitely i will try to resolve your query okay thank you have a nice day take care